I was an overweight kid, and yeah, I was good. I, I played sports. I varsity. I played basketball. I played football. Wrestled. I even did comp squad cheerleading. I went head to head with uh, Stoli Stefan Pedersen, uh, the Icelandic guy. Most of these places, like um, In Motion, these other places out here, are for country clubbers or people that just want to lift the weight and just want to go in there and socialize. They're not there to drive the iron, bend the bars, you know. I've always had that stigma about not being able to do it and people putting me down because of my hand size because I don't have the biggest hands. Like my favorite exercises would have to be shrugs and uh, clearly, you know, I love traps. Legs, I love working legs. Deadlifts, squats, leg press, anything that involves legs. You know, I love it. But my training, everything has changed in the last month. My diet, everything has become stricter because I want to win. Finding the meals is hard, but I always eat all day. And I make sure what I eat is clean and big and I get the calories and the protein. Sometimes I just got to get the food in me. And just being so tired, sometimes it's like I don't want to cook. And sometimes there's food at home and I was like, I need more food, I need more food. You see these dudes, I'm going to do arms, I'm going to do chest. And all they do is curl and bench press. That's cool, but it don't help you. you. Ain't ever gonna win a bodybuilding show or anything, really. You know, it, those exercises ain't gonna do much. It's just for your ego. I listen to anything strong, hard, uplifting. Uh, five finger death punch, Lamb of God. You know, mostly metal or hardcore rock is what I listen to when I'm lifting. When I'm doing cardio, I listen to Taylor Swift and Cascada is what I listen to.